Hello everybody, it's Miss Saha. This video is for all my friends in the diagnostic kindergarten class with Miss Young and Miss Hassan. Hello! Should we sing our hello song? Let's do it! I brought a shaker today. If you have a shaker or something to make a little noise at home, go ahead and play along. Hello! Everybody, I'm so glad to see you. Hello, everybody, we're so glad to see you. Hello to Xavier, I'm so glad to see you. Hello to Leo, I'm so glad to see you too. Hello to Fatima, I'm so glad to see you. Hello. To Fenton, I'm so glad to see you too. Hello to Christopher, I'm so glad to see you. Hello to Philmon, I'm so glad to see you. Hello to Ethan, I'm so glad to see you. Hello to Elliot, I'm so glad to see you. Hello, Miss. Saha. We're so glad to see you. Hello, everybody. We're so glad to see you. Can you make a low noise and a high noise with me? Let's go low. Let's go high. That's fun. Today, we're going to be adding some words to fun things that we like to do. I have a toy here with lots of little things inside. Can you see the things that are inside there? Oh, some of them just fell out. We're going to be playing a game of in and out. Ready? Can you say in every time with me? In, 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 in. Ready to dump it? Out. One more time. In. In, 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 out. That's fun. Let's find another way we can play that game if we don't have toys. Opening and closing. Let's open and close and add words. Open, close. Open, close. Should we count this time? Let's do some counting. Every time I'm gonna dump, it's gonna make a loud noise. Ready? Dump. Every time we put one in, let's count it. One, two, three, four, five, six, Seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. Ready? Ready for close? Close. Shake. Open, dump, oh, dump is fun, close. Parents at home, attaching simple words like shake, open, close, dump, and counting or saying the colors of things is a great way to play with oral language and encourage your child to try their hand or their voice at speaking. 
we have a song that we like to do together um, all about the colors of the rainbow. Should we sing it today and share it with your parents? Let's go. Red and yellow, green and blue, green and blue, green and blue. Red and yellow, green and blue, orange and purple too. Can we find each of the colors? Yellow. Green. Blue. Orange. Purple. Let's put it together and sing it again. Red and yellow, green and blue, orange and purple too. That was fun. Parents, you can play that game at home. Just get a little dish or bowl and find one thing of each color to play and sing along. Can your child match the word they're saying with the colors in the bowl? That's a great activity for home. Speaking of opening and closing things, did you notice the way this opens and closes by pulling off the lid? Working on our finger or fine motor skills together at home is easy too. Look for things that open in different ways. This is a child safe container that, um, depending what's in it, that um, opens with a screw top. Well, I've put some bigger pieces of pasta in it, dry pasta, so it can be used a few ways. It can be used to work on the target words open and close, or twist and dump. You can work on the target words in and out as you take the pasta in and out of the container. You can work on counting or you can start your own band and that's super fun. Lots of families have McDonald's toys at home like these. These are great for uh, working on target words and developing our, our, our oral language. Um, what words can I can I use for this? Push, 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 spin. The dog is spinning. Round and round and round he goes. He starts and he stops. This is a great toy because every time I press a button, something either does or doesn't happen. So I'm going to say either yes or no. Ready? We'll find out how many no's we get before a yes and something fun will happen. Here I go. No. No. No, no, yes, that was so exciting. Should we play again? Ready? Okay, no, 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 no. Oh, that's my favorite. This is a fun one too. I'm going to have to move my camera so you can see it on the table though. Before I do, let me show you a few more. We can work on in and out and up and down, up, down, 
up, down, or we can work on open and close, open, close. Now you say it. Open, close, good job. Let's move the camera down to the table and see what Miss Saha has here. Back, go. Let's try it again. Back, go. Back, go, that one was better. And then, There's a fun, exciting part too. That really goes. You probably have lots of little toys like this at home. Try this this week. Attach language target words to each of those actions and activities of your toys that do things. And if you don't have toys that do things, you can make your own using some simple things from around the house. Well, I hope you had a great time and that you, oops, and that you look for things um, to have fun and learning at home and remember our color song and look for some simple, fun activities to work on target words together with your family. Goodbye, Xavier. Goodbye, Leo. Goodbye, Fatima and Fenton. Goodbye, Christopher and Felmon. Goodbye, Ethan, and goodbye, Elliot. Goodbye, Miss Young. Goodbye, Miss Hassan. I'll see you later, alligator, and in a while, crocodile.